All right, what's up, everybody? It's the Refractor Line live every Monday and Wednesday, 4.30 Central, 5.30 Eastern. And we're going to open up some Nightfall stuff today. Me and Matt here chilling with you. Yeah. Matt, what do you got over there? I have one release event box, and I have one spell book. The spell book is just going to dominate this camera, but just to prove that I have it. There it is. Boom, and I have a spell book as well and a blister pack. Um, and we're going to kind of show what's everything. I mean, you know, there's been a lot of openings out there, but you know what, guys? Not quite like us. We I never get tired of it. Opening. Oh, man, these are so much fun. And I think there's a lot of good buys out there from, well, for Nightfall, there's some cheap individual cards. I'll put yeah, I agree. And we, we talked about this a little bit uh, mm -hmm. in the Discord, is that the the prices of some of the singles for Nightfall have come down to really attainable levels. Not that they weren't attainable before, but um, if, if you appreciate the Nightfall set and you, you want to get in on singles, like now is the time to jump yeah. in, I think, more than ever. Um, and yeah, be, you know, if you're excited about the game taking off, this will be some cheap stuff. Yeah. All right. So what do we got there, man? Three packs. There we go. There's all this stuff. Ooh. Another coaster, aka rule book. You get the rule book. We've got lots of rule book, guys. Yep. It's a compli you know, it's a complicated enough game. So if you need I, a rule I got, book. Uh, I got the old spider grandmother. I love this. I love the art on the spider grandmother. I think that's a great one. There's uh, several different. Uh, Hollows you can get on the uh, yes. event box. So the different hollows you can get, there's you can kind of see the art there. I yeah. Don't, I don't remember which ones are which, but you know. But so you got the spider, so that's kind of cool. Yep. Okay. Spider grandmother. They give you a release event medal. Release event medal. Those are always nice. Those always sell for a few bucks. And they give you three packs. Three packs. And you know what? I've seen a lot of hollows. I've yeah. seen a lot of hollows, yeah. Matt. I think uh, when we opened one of mine, I think I got one hollow. It was the uh, the Jack Frost hollow. Jack, I love Jack Frost. You know, I think if, if you want to kind of get in on the game, start studying what cards are good. You might get a leg up on some cheap Nightfall cards. Yep. Okay. Um, here we go. First pack. We'll go Lovewig, Pyre, Bubbling Brew, Exquisite Stew, we Lightning have, Alley. Ooh. We got a reverse hollow. Reverse hollow Lightning Alley. Nice. There's can that. I see the uh, reverse hollow? Absolutely, you can. I like it because it's an artifact essence, guys. So this is kind of what, you know, that, that creates aura for the game. I think these are great cards. I actually just bought a Kickstarter black hole shard. Oh, I, nice. I wanted it because Doug was talking about how he had, was it the whole set the of whole the Kickstarter? The whole set of Kickstarter artifacts. Yeah. yeah. I think that's a great buy. Yeah. So I'm like, you know what? I kind of want to see if I can find one for a reasonable price. Man, I like the Nightfall art. I think it's cool. It uh, is I'm very enjoying good. these so far. Like, that's a funny looking little troll, dude. Yeah, Caster Center. Caster Center MD. Reverse Hollow Arkansas Snipe. Arkansas Snipe. Okay, so a couple Reverse Hollows so far. That, that's, you know, not great, but okay. There's still time. Not bad. Okay. Okay, last pack. Last pack. And uh, again, you know, three packs in this uh, release event box. I think MSRP was around $20, $25. Yeah. So if you it, could it's get a these, great deal. If you could get these for about $35 or so, dollars, I mean, the, the promo that you get in and of itself is probably worth at least half of that. Mm -hmm. So you shouldn't have any problem making your money back if you pull any sort of decent hollow. Yes, yes. As far as, you know, things go to buy, that might be something to look at and get it cheaper. Correct. Don't get the spell book too much, too much reverse yeah, hollow. Yeah, spell books, we were under the impression when we bought them that I think they had gotten their stuff fixed. And, just... and they did not. Did not. All right. Oh, man. Momo, Prism, Prism Grimace. So this looks like Grimace to us, but he got, he got swole. He got all jacked in prison. So he hit the weights. It was just a misdemeanor. Don't worry about the it. Stinky punch. So again, yeah, I think there's a lot of funny uh, attacks and things like that and powers that might set some beasties apart. Because right now everyone knows, oh, the unlucky 13. Okay, well, what else? You know, so mm -hmm. it'd be interesting. Take a look at the game. But yeah, man, I, I, you know, reverse hollows, but overall, overall I, I love that promo card you get. I think that's great. Yeah. It's, uh, yeah, it, as the far spider as... spider grandmother. I bang for your buck. I think you, you can't really do much better than the event box. It's a quick yeah. quick pop, three packs, but you get mm -hmm. a promo, two promos if you count the release event now. So, um, I didn't get any hollows this time around, but... I don't know. Are we going to change the luck with the spell book, Matt? Maybe. Maybe this what do you, will do What do it. you think, Mark? Okay, so spell books, guys, we've been seeing. If you get one full hollow, you should be happy. Which is just insane when you really... Think about that because you get so, 10 packs. It's disappointing, but I think they might be able to redeem themselves with, with you know. I mentioned making this, the, the, the promo is a great promo. I, I could say that, you know. I think the promo card looks cool. Yeah, yep. Um, I think the play mat, Matt, you could show that yep. real quick. So you get one play mat. 
I think that's uh, kind of sharp, but it's you know, it's just it's just a piece of it's, it's very heavy plastic. Very plasticky. You know. I, you know, it's not enough room for me to open this thing, but yeah, it looks like a. I mean, it's cool, but yeah, it's just a piece of like yeah, yeah. poster board, you know. Yeah, it's like a M M McDonald's menu or something you yeah. get. You got a coaster, aka rule book. The rule book. If you haven't Never, already, you might have dozens have of too those. many rules. You get your nightfall promo. I think it's a great looking promo. Yep, I, I love that one. Um, ten packs. You got your ten booster packs. Get all these out of here. Yeah. Your sleeves. Mm -hmm. Your deck. And the sleeves are higher quality. Yep. These are higher quality sleeves compared to what you got before. Mm -hmm. Ten packs. And is that a hollow on top of that deck, or no? Is that just a it regular not, cosmic? just a regular just cosmic. Regular cosmic. Yeah. It used to be a hollow on top, I guess not anymore, but there's a, a brick of uh, aura and stuff. And, last but not least... Last but not least, coin. And this is what I kind of want to talk about, guys, just a second here. It's like, if these spell books really stunk, this is how they could redeem it. Because this coin, I don't know, exchange it for something awesome. I I'm not sure what that awesome thing would be, but that's how you'd redeem it. You know, a Kickstarter pack, I, I don't know. Down the road, yeah. I mean, down the road. That's how you, you know, totally redeem yourself. God willing. I mean, with these spell books having so few hollows, like people are constantly trying to find reasons <clears throat> to buy them. Mm -hmm. The coin may be, may be the key to that. Down maybe the, road. the key. Yeah. Yep. Okay, so we're gonna let's go through these packs, man. I'm feeling it. So we want, we want to beat one hollow. If you get two full hollows, I think you had a good spell book. I, which is so sad, but so true. Just a little bit lower than that. Yep. There we go. Now I'm on it. Veggie Man. Veggie Man. Yep. Okay. One reverse. Okay. Okay. One reverse. Uh, Veggie Man. Uh, I don't know if I've seen too much of the Veggie Man. He looks like the BFG. For those of uh, actually really not the BFG. Uh, BFG made of vegetables. Yeah, maybe a mix of the BFG and like a Grinch. Yeah. There you go. I Big like friendly it. Grinch. Mm -hmm. All right. Pack two. Pack two. Let's do it. Oh. Wonk, Wonk and Squonk, I think are gonna be a be a combo. Of people Good. are gonna be afraid of. Good. You never have too many. Either. But uh, another reverse hollow. So yes. Over two. And there's also those Terra cards at the end. I mean, you know, Terra is one of those interesting things that might be one day worth something. You know. The packs are always gonna be. The cards themselves are always gonna mm -hmm. value, just maybe not monetarily. Mm -hmm. Mark, do you have a favorite Nightfall? I don't really have a favorite Nightfall card yet. Murphy's Bureau Mud Monster. That's kind of fun looking card. But again, a reverse hollow. Um, <clears throat> I really want to go through the Nightfall stuff and kind of, you know, start playing. But really, those theme decks, I need them. You know, they're right around the corner. Yeah. Do you so, have an ETN one years of getting here? No, I did not get an updated email. Maybe. So uh, I'm unsure, but I have two sets coming, guys. So I want to I wanna open those. We'll open them live. And uh, that's when you could really start playing. Okay, another reverse. The... Faux Follet, yeah. Beastie Spirit. That looks right. Good looking card. It is a cool looking card. Again, I love the art of Nightfall. I think Nightfall is some of the best looking art. Yep. Speaking of uh, art, Mark, we did uh, we did notice that there is a post of, what was it, one of the Paul brothers looking at Metazoo cards? Yeah, one of the Paul brothers looking at Metazoo. Or no, was he looking at Metazoo? Yeah, he was looking at Metazoo. The guy yeah. was wearing the Metazoo t-shirt and stuff. I'm not exactly what sure what exactly cards they were looking at. I thought it was Metazoo cards. But again, any exposure they could get I think is great. I agree. Um, the Columbia River Band Wonk. Squink. 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 Sand, Sand squink. squink. Sand Squink. Okay. I don't know if we've seen him. I don't think I've seen that. Okay, so Mothman Plane. Um, they said Mothman is not going to be in the Wilderness set, so Correct. something to keep an eye on. Yeah, they said know. that uh, Bigfoot is going to be the... Uh, Bigfoot's going to be the new, the new uh, mascot or, uh, you know... And subsequently, I did notice that the market value for Bigfoot's from Cryptid Nation has gone up. Mm. Great. Yeah. It should. So if you had if you had a uh, some shares in Bigfoot from Crypto Nation. Yeah, you'll be looking good. You'll be looking good. Yeah. I think I remember like I think he's invisible. That's like something nice about him. That's just like the real Bigfoot. Yeah, right? No, well there you go. Uh, see I love the art of these. The Bell Witch Beastie Witch. Another reverse hollow. So we're kinda getting killed on those. That's but... surprising. But again, you know, if you're if you're gonna start playing the game, this is you know kind of a cheaper with a booster box. You're getting in at half the price, a third of the price. Yeah. You're getting sleeves. You're getting that stack of aura, so you can play. Correct. Okay. The old land tax. <laughs> oh man, tax man cometh. Next is gonna be the IRS caster. Um, Tahini hand. Yeah, 
Tyne Tynehan, something like that. Yeah, however you want to pronounce it. I threw an N in there. Is there one in there? I don't know. But that's kind of cool looking. It kind of looks like a fun troll thing with a schnoz. Yeah. Like, there yeah. you go. Don't they all, you know? There you go. He's kind of a fun troll dude. His, uh, <laughs> his attack is vicious assault. So. Oh, no. Yeah. Don't be by a bridge or something. No, no, no. I don't know. Ask you a riddle or two. Yeah, right. Uh, okay. Let's go full hollow. I like our odds in this one. No nope. reverse. Tuttle Bottoms monster. That's kind of cool. Looks like a... I don't know what he looks like. An anteater or something? Yeah. Okay. I have two packs left. Two packs left. Okay, man. Eight reverse hollows so far. Oh, for eight. You know what? It's usually one of the late ones that you get it. Uh, you get one? I'm just making a fly. I was going to say, I'm yeah, you really had it. me going there. I'm believing in it. No stackleties yet. No, no, no. Mm. That will be disappointing. Headless? None. Um... Reverse. Yep. But cool art. I mean, you know, I, yeah, I've said it a hundred times. I do like it. It is good looking. It's aesthetically pleasing. Which you needed that kind of upgrade to. So, you know. You know what would be more aesthetically pleasing is if I pulled a full hollow. Full hollow right here. Of anything. I would take anything. Okay, right. here we go. <clears throat> no, wonk. Another, another wonk. Another Mothman. A bunch of Terra stuff, Island. Uh, All right, Mark. Well, let's hope you have better luck than okay, I do. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna open up my spell book now, and we'll see maybe. And a blister packs, folks, folks, and uh, let's just see what happens. Let's see what happens, man. Maybe I'll get a little better luck. So, guys, we're gonna do the blister pack first here, and uh, you can see you get a Jersey Devil, you get a coin, you mm -hmm. get a pack. And the cool thing is, you know, there's tons of these purple coins now around now. I think I saw you could, you know, someone bought like 20 of them for 50 bucks. I mean, you, really? want, that you, want a, you want a purple coin, you can get a purple coin. And especially, like we said, like if these coins lead to something, if you can get a coin, any coin for essentially $2 a piece and a heart on a large lot like that, like it may be worthwhile to just kind of take a chance on whether it's one of those vending machines Doug had been talking about or just anything. Even mm -hmm. if it's an autograph ticket, essentially, like that could be a value down the road, so. Yeah, and those are really cheap. So I'm unsure if they're, you know, they're gonna make a, these cards kind of the coins all worth something different. Right. But until we know for sure, it might be worth getting on it, getting any ones you can get your hands on. So there you go. Here's one. Here's the coin. Boom. Here is Jersey Devil. All right, Matt. What do you think? I think you're gonna have a full hollow, Mark. Full hollow. Let's yeah, hope. I think if so. not, I might be screwed because it's full of anything. I thought that was faculties. Okay, full hollow. full hollow. Boil, boil over. over. There you go. Is boil over an unlucky uh, 13? Uh, off the top of my head, I do not know. It's a nice card. It is a nice card. The I do I'm, like one it. One for one. You got the piece of bird and you got uh, Loveland Frogman in the background. Yes. Kind of hanging out. Let me uh, let me do some some research here. Great. Mark. Okay. Okay, guys. So I feel uh, really good about that. Yeah. Uh, yeah man, I don't want to get our cards mixed up. That's here. okay. <laughs> yeah. Right. <laughs> no, it doesn't matter. Uh, no. Boil over mark is unlucky thirteen. There you go, guys. I think so. There you go. That blister pack between between these, you know, the Jersey Devil boil over. And the coin. I mean, that was worth it right there. There's uh, just under $20 I think I, sp I spent for that. That was a little bit higher, but MSRP, I think, was like $7. Is that correct, Matt? I think that's correct, yes. All right. So, we're going on to the spell book. What do I expect? Oh, man, at least two full hollows, man. <laughs> Woo -wee. That's, all, that's all you can ever hope for. It's okay to dream. So, again, we showed there's the mat. You get the promo card, which I think is a very slick promo card. Mm -hmm. Your coaster. Which is the rule book. <laughs> your stack of aura, which you're gonna need to play the game. Your sleeves, they're higher quality than the first edition, so that's good. Mm -hmm. Boom, right there, the black coin. I think that's gonna be worth something someday, Matt. I think that's how they're gonna pay us back. You think so? I hope so. I'd be right with that. I hope so. And at the bottom, I don't know, Matt, you showed this, but there's all the yeah. tokens. The tokens, yeah. So you have, you know, sleep, Freeze, scare, fear, poison, burn, 
I noticed that a lot of a lot of the token sheets come with them already like punched out. Yes, it seems they fell out during packaging. Yeah, I don't know if there's an appeal. And then there's your 10. 10. All right, guys, let's go through them. Good luck, Mark. Thank you. I, I believe it. And these are, uh, you know, these packs are super easy to rip open. So it's like ripping tin foil. Mm -hmm. If you can't get to a chocolate chip cookie, I, I can't help you. Nope, your problem. Okay. Oh, reverse hollow. Who is that? Axe handle hound. Axe handle hand, reverse hollow. That's kind of cool. I like that art. It's a good one. All right. Oh, for one. That's fine. It's okay. Not unexpected. Cause I got the boil over. I'm feeling. I'm feeling good. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Anything on top of that. Yeah, you should. Oh man, I keep on thinking that stack of teams, but it's excavation. We mode. haven't pulled one yet. Yeah, Doug's gonna be pissed. Very upset. Oh. Frank Shaw's gargoyle. Frank Shaw's gargoyle. Pretty cool. Mm -hmm. Reverse hollow again, but mm -hmm. cool looking card. And then uh, you know. Obsidian Obelisk, things like this you just, you know, that are helpful to play. Yes, Tara. yeah. You're going to need all of that. It's so. worth keeping all the cards if you have intentions of playing, because every card is going to be important, especially the Aura and Terra cards. Like, those are the things you're going to want to hold on to. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Fun fact, Kickstarter Terra is incredibly hard to find. Is it really? Yeah, go try to find it. Is that a, is that a dare? No, I'm saying if you want, like, a <laughs> sneaky collectible thing, <laughs> and someone doesn't know, take you. their Kickstarter Terra. Oh, there you go, same Another guy. Axe handle hound. Another axe handle. There you go. Okay. And they don't screw someone out of their terror. That's really kind of not ethical. Yeah. If they don't know what they have, you might want to let them know. The That's Kickstarter terror because there was only two per pack, and uh, there's just not a lot out there. Oh, I didn't even think about that. That's why it's so hard to play the game. No one can really play the game. Yep. Mm-hmm. All right, I'm feeling it. Oh, okay. Bell witch. Yep. Bell witch reverse. Okay, guys. No. St okay, Stackleties. This pack, Matt. It's a black pack. I like you know, black Stackleties. Packs. Is an unlucky thirteen as well. I believe. Is he really? I think so. Oh, man. Excavation again, man. Come on, Mark. Pull something. That's cool looking. That's oh, looking. here we go. Oh, another French gargoyle. gargoyle. French Shaw's gargoyle. Okay, so we got a little clumping going on. Roofing, really. But they could call it clumping. I don't like clump. I like group. I like group too. Okay, guys, full hollow. I'm feeling it this one. Or stackleties. Or st either or. Oh, reverse. Okay, those. there's yeah, the anteater dude. Of those. Puddle bottoms monster. Again, reverse hollow. Nothing but reverses. But I'm glad I got that boil over full hollow. Like, the only man, yeah, the only full, you know, full hollow we've gotten so far I'm among go, all of our packs is from your blister. I might go buy some individuals. Oh, that's a good one. Grim Reaper. Grim Reaper reverse. Grim Reaper is a great card because yeah. um, it's fun because it kind of ends the game. But you need nine aura. Yeah. So if you're at that point, you're at end game probably. You got a, anyway. a non-hollow Mothman in there as well. Yeah, non-hollow Mothman in there as well. You know, I shouldn't, you know, I poo-poo him don't, like don't he's nothing. That. Yeah, sorry, guys. Jeez, I'm coming over here like a jerk. That's all right. I don't think he holds it against you. Mm, hopefully not. I don't hope not. There's the Axe Hound, no hollow. Well, that's a cool one, Colin. Mm -hmm. Frostbite. Oh, oh man, those. our guy. Uh, Tihi Han. Yeah, that's it's something like that. Cool troll dude. We'll tell you a riddle under a under a bridge or something. Okay, two packs left, guys. We just gotta get one one full hollow. Man, what would it say if we got zero full hollows between our two spells? Between our two, it'd say make that damn black coin worth something, buddy. Better be. Oh, I thought that was stack with these yeah, for a second. Yeah, me too. I froze. I had to do a double take. Uh, fire fall or full fall that. Full fall Oh, there, wait. Look at the next card. Mark. Oh, man. Oh, jeez. I almost blew there right you past go. it. There I'm go. putting this in the hollow stack. I'm going to pretend. Maybe, is it too late to put that in the PSA shipment? Man, well, <laughs> probably. Well, here you go. I don't know. Doug's going to autograph anything. There you go. We'll set that We'll set that one aside. <laughs> uh, we'll put that one in the background. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's maybe, a separate pile. Maybe Doug will autograph and we'll frame that back there. Uh, All right. Last pack, guys. Last pack. Let's get a full hollow. 
for the people. For the people. No, oh, I got that one too, Mark. Lightning Alley. So again, the uh, artifact essence I think is cool. It creates the aura. Mm -hmm. and, you know, I mean, it's something useful. So you're going to need it in the game. But overall, eh. Eh, 0 for 10. And I was 0 for 10. So I was we 0 for 0, 13, really. Yeah, so we were uh, 0 for 20 on the spell books, guys. That's rough. Matt, you were 0 for 3 on the event box, which that's the first Correct. time I've seen 0 for 3 on the event box. That. So The only full hollow came out of your blister pack. Man, that blister pack was great. I guess blister pack is the way to go. Find Might those be. at MSRP. But uh, spell books, guys, uh, secondary market, I don't think I'd buy them. No, no, I'm off spell books. The pricing has come down a little bit if you look at China. Yeah, Fireball, if you want anything, you know, maybe buy the promo. Get yourself one of those. Get yourself a black coin. Yep. Just don't even buy the spell book. Just buy those two individually and move on. Yeah, I agree. If you just want to cut out the red meat, just buy what you buy what you want out of this instead of just buying the spell book to kind of yeah. piece it out. Yep. I so, agree. Cool. Well, there you go, guys. Catch us on live Monday, Wednesday, 4.30 Central, 5.30 Eastern. Mm -hmm. We'll be here. The Refractor Line. Come by, say hi. Come say what's up. We're live. We'll talk to the chat. We'll talk to you. Leave a comment. We'll chat with you. We'll talk to you. We'll say what's up. If you got any questions about cards you have, so lucky you. All right. Peace, guys. See you guys.